Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate 3 with Theodore Remington. Well, last time we uh, kind of fought a whole bunch of gnolls and saved these uh, fellows here from a tough pickle, which turned out that they were actually Zantarine fellows. Who are bad. So we uh, kind of blackmailed them well, into giving uh, them giving us our stuff. And they were like, oh, that's actually kind of cool. You can work for us now. So, yeah, we can have this uh, box. It's locked. Uh, now, we could, obviously, we could try and pick this open. But I, for a fact, uh, after some experimentation, you know, it's better to just take it. We, we don't, we won't, uh, we won't actually open the box. We'll just pick it up. And we'll just take the box as is with us. What path lies before me? Mm. It seems a very weird one, but it, 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 at least I think it'll pay off. I honestly never took this. Uh, it's an experiment we're doing. I think it'll fit. Uh, Trap. Be cautious. Okay. A bit hard to see here. Stuff. Uh, can I? Yeah, move it there. Thank you. Pretty good use of some new weaponry, hopefully soon. Uh, we add our usual bonuses to things. Don't need cat's grace for this. Yeah, that's fine. Here, easy peasy, lock breaky squeezy. Uh, reasons grass. Whenever it ends their rates, can turn temporary. That's nice. That's very nice. I think we'll. Hey, Does she have gloves? No, she doesn't really. Okay. Well, Kalak, we got some new gloves for you. There we go. Let's get going. More magic for us, lovely. Open heresy. We're gonna show the gods of creation, Saluna is the goddess of destruction. Yeah, both are true. Okay, there's a whole long philosophical thought of the nature of Shar and Saloon, who are supposed to be the, first, the two primeval goddesses, uh, kind of, of the realms. We take all the booze. I'm tempted to take all the booze. Let's take all the booze. And I should never want the easy path. Okay, this is always a tricky one, so let's. Uh, I've been through here a few times. Um, let's actually split up the group. We'll jump over here. I thought there were locks to pick here. Is there nothing here? Am I mistaken? Well, there's a lock trunk. That might have valuables. Yeah, it does. A bunch of shiny gems and gold. I think it's easier to jump from here, actually. And we're back here. Okay. Oh, a heavy crossbow. That's actually a nice weapon. Let's try and get that. That will make us encumbered, but... We'll probably end up giving it to someone anyway. Mm. Well, lad, it's our lucky day after all. I don't feel lucky. The rest of our crew's half digested. Right, so we will replace uh, our longbow with uh, the heavy crossbow because I think it's actually sort of better. Yeah, and it's cooler looking. Uh. No time to dally. Can she use? Yes, she can. Okay, here she goes, so she has a bow as well. 
No one's stopped me. Oh, blood, I think. At least I think so. What am I to do? Oh no, she's not proficient in it, so this is a poor idea. Could just for security. Yeah, we'll just. He probably won't use it because he has the whole range things, but he can at least. Yeah, he is at least proficient with things. Don't burn yourself. And she already has a longbow. Okay. Never a dull moment. Okay, let us see if we can dump some equipment on people. Uh, I'll just have Carla carry a bunch of old weaponry. And the sexy clothes we got off the drow. Okay, that should be fine. Don't waste a stem. So, what else is there to loot about here? Alchemist fire. I don't think we'll need that one. Not a happy crossbow! I'm collecting that. Yeah, they're heavy, but they're pretty much better in every other way. I think we'll pass this one to Karlak. Actually, is this a simple weapon or is this a martial weapon? Could give it to. My face protects me. No, it's martial. Okay. Damn, it's good to be alive. Then we'll give it to Karlak for a better ranged option. There we go. All right, what now? Very well. Okay, and down the hole well, we well. go. It's our lucky day after all. Mm. I don't feel lucky. The rest of our crew's half digested, and you're still alive. That's lucky. Okay, jump over the bridge. <clears throat> yeah. I have fallen for this trap many times. I'm not going to this time. See that that support in the big boulder? Yeah. I didn't feel like dealing with that. Okay, and that just leads back. And this is alcohol, so this also catches fire. I guess Will couldn't make the jump. Hmm. Oh, fire, fire, stay out of the fire. All right, so let us see if we can maybe go and deliver this big box of uh, good stuff. And get the herbs. Given how wounded we are, we should also take a short rest, so. Short rest it is. I can keep going a little longer now. Excellent. Ominous music that's playing. I wonder if there's a storm brewing. Welcome to the League of the Lone Eye, my friend. Oh. Not to minimize the pain of Volo's okay. poking and prodding, but I promise you'll be used to the prosthesis in no time. Besides, I find it gives one an air of mystique. See, I wish no we had like a cool eye like than a man he has. with one eye. But th that's the fun, I never realized he would respond to it. Makes sense. So now we're one-eyed bros. Just like our one-eyed willies. <laughs> and his name is Will! He is a one-eyed willy! Yes! It fits! 
Will the one-eyed willy! I wonder if they did that on purpose, I don't know. Uh, no, I was not... I'm not planting a garden here, I'm picking up stuff. Okay, let's explore over here. Cause, yeah, this seems to be new grounds. Oh. Hello, signpost. Welcome to Joaquin's Rest. West, Baldur's Gate. East, Elturel. Okay. Yeah, so we're between Baldur's Gate and Elturel. Smoke. Something's burning. Yeah, we can see that. This is not good. Hello? Are you okay? He of the unsleeping eyes. Grant me the might to carry this burden. Grant me the faith to face darkness without fear. Uh, my condolences to you. He should never have been here in the first place. I'm the one that talked him into joining the fist. What the hell happened here then? A massacre. Drow and goblins slaughtered the lot. Please, just leave me be. Yeah, that uh, seems like they have a bit of a problem here. Yeah. Shouting. Someone needs help. All right, let's rush to it then. Keep pushing. Duke Raven Guard could be inside. On count to three. One, two. Raven Guard. He's here. Yes. Now make yourself useful. Push, damn it, push. I will help push. Because I am a strong orc man. Could use some potions here. Uh, I think honestly with just some guidance. We should be fine. Yeah. The, hmm, when do we get to use the potion? I think we'll just take the elixir. We can make new ones later. Well, it's a, it's a good thing we took the elixir, else we uh, would not have succeeded. Yeah! Inside! Hurry! We don't have much time! Will do. You hear me? We hear you! Stay where you are! We don't have much time! Find out! Anyone here? Hello! Hello! Okay, it doesn't look like there's someone here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's lots of smoke. Oh, there's someone there! Coming off that door. Opening it could spell trouble. Okay, so we don't open that door. Can't smash through that, though. Oh! There's someone there. Oh! Holy shit! Okay. Did not warn me of that. Why did it all explode? Oh. Is he dead? <coughs> the fire! Hurry! Get this thing off me! I'll try! Use, uh, we can use our brains though. Let's use our brains... First, yeah. Oh. It's tough to use our brains. But, that is I think just enough of brain usage. Yes. I think that's it. Uh, thank you. Now, how the hell do we get out of here? Uh, come follow me. I'll be keep you safe. 
Right! I'll try to keep up. Okay, so we're in turn based modes. Now that place blew up. I should probably call for potion while we're at it. I'd love to, thanks. I think oh, yeah. Carla can walk through the fire. She should be oh. fine with that. Not entirely fine with that, I guess. Let's get on with it. Uh, I don't think we want uh, Shadow Hot uh, to walk onward. into the fire. We're a little bit in the way, also, by the way. I don't think we need to. Can't jump? Okay, that's very unfortunate. Oh, now we can jump. That should be safe. Sharp as ever. Probably need to dash here as well. <clears throat> there we go. Stick out, stay out of fire, as it were. Maybe later. Okay, cool. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Holy shit, everything's on fire. Wow, a lot here is on fire. This is a problem. Oof. Uh, oh, maybe we should take the back door. I've got a long road ahead. Yeah, I made a bit of a mistake here, I think. If not over, then through. And we're on fire already. Anyway, can we bash this? Excellent! That means our car doesn't have to walk through the fire. That, that's uh, a lot more safe, I feel. Does he count as safe now? Okay. Making me sweat. What's next? Ah, okay. He can get out that way. Oh, and apparently a quest where he needs to find his wife we're already solved because we accidentally let him to his wife's corpse straight away. Aren't we lucky? Ah, uh, okay. So Theodore needs to get the hell out of there. Another step forward. Okay. Yeah, we have been good heroes. Excellent. Now, if we jump to... Over. Would like to just walk by. We, we can walk by here. Okay. Hmm. That's annoying. Why can't I just jump to this little bit here? I guess we can go onto the roof, I guess. How oh, can I zoom out now, please? I guess we can also jump down, but that'll cost us some. Yeah, maybe that's the better option now. And we're at least out of the fire. What's the story? Okay, so I guess the saving here will be done by our party. Uh, just choppy choppy here, yeah, well. Very good. There's no time to waste. Got to keep moving. That's 
actually enter mid mode. Come! I'm afraid proper thanks must wait. Okay, well we'll explore the burning bear right building now. when we have um, well, in it. means oh, of not burning. Here. I think we can just better just uh, yeah I honestly we can just run downstairs I think that should be fine Theodore I would appreciate you not going in here please Uh, I didn't want to do this. Are you all right? Well, with Carlac, honestly. By the main God, what's become of you? A story best left for calmer days. Now breathe deeply. Are you in pain? Thankfully, Will seems to be handling Scorched the talking threats. anyway. A few hairs singed off. Nothing a bit of time and, and fresh air can't cure. Gauntlet, a new duty calls. Drow have taken Grand Duke Alder Ravenguard westward. If my eyes and ears can be believed, um, hmm. report to the Manic and send for reinforcements. We must find the Duke. On your command, Councillor. No, Not to. Uh... You mean they've taken my. Yes. Yes, well, again. The Drow have your father. Oh! Okay, that's a reveal I didn't know. Will, you're the son of nobility? The Even circumstance this of my birth them. is no matter of pride for neither me nor my father. But pride is no reason to refuse help to my own flesh and blood. How can we help? Rescue Ravenguard from his drow captors. Baldur's Gate needs him now more than ever. Trust us to see it through, Counselor. Yes, um, and, uh... I'll see this is interesting. As I said, Duke Grave was kidnapped. Again. Because if you play Descent to Avernus prequel adventure, he also gets ki sort of kidnapped there. So he just keeps getting kidnapped, that guy. I don't know why. Mm, the Absolute uh, Cult is based in Moonrise Tower. That's where they'll have taken the Duke. Moonrise Towers? Along the old road, that place is cursed. Few could survive there, unless darker forces are at work. This was no random Probably. attack. The Grand Duke was their target. Ravengard is a champion of the people of Bowler's Gate, is he not? A champion indeed. He's the invisible force holding Baldur's Gate together. Without him, he's invisible. The city faces collapse. In fact, I fear that may have been the intention of those who abducted him. I'll head west and find Duke Ravengarten. Thank you. When the Grand Duke returns to the city, he'll hail his only son, a hero. Approach the towers with care. The land itself has been swallowed in shadow. I will seek reinforcements and join you when I can. Remember, Will, courage is found in the battle against fear, not in the defeat of it. So Father said. I won't soon forget. Fist to work. We are going to have to ask Will some questions about this. Oh, and we get a choice of uh, stuff. So we have a jolt shooter. Which is a slightly magic bow, slightly magic staff, or a slightly magic trident. I think we'll go for the bow, honestly. Can I? Yeah, thank you all. We'll go for the bow. What to do? Let's get out of the fire. So let's have a rest and have a talk with Will that about this. Edge off. Shit. Yes. You can put distance between you and yesterday, but you'll never leave it fully behind. 
Father's words. Hard to argue with them. Floric spoke true. I'm a Grand Duke's son. Well, he's not just any Grand Duke. He's Alder Ravenguard. The most influential Duke in the city. Well, what was that story then about uh, your uncle or something not being able to spell? time in Baldur's Gate. I didn't even know Raven Guard had children, honestly. Just the one. Yours truly. My father and I were close once upon a time, until he disowned me and cast me out of Baldur's Gate. I can't tell you more. The pact forbids it. My lips are quite literally sealed. He made me an exile. That said, I'm not about to let him suffer at the hands of his captors. What do you think your drought won with your father? I've been asking myself the same question. Chaos, probably. What makes a Duke of Baldur's Gate so interesting to the drow? Even the houses of Menzo Baranzan would have little use for my father. No. Really? This is no I can think plot. of some uses. These absolute nutters, these true souls are behind his abduction. His absence alone will sow chaos in the city. If they were to infect him, he could lead Baldur's Gate to ruin. All the more reason to find him. The Absolute has seized not just my father, but the future of the Sword Coast. That's a problem. All right, let's go then. And let's see about the gentleman with his dead wife. He's still crying upstairs. Yeah, he is. Mary. No. Gods, no, no, no. You should have stayed. You should have been with me. What exactly happens here? I can give her uh, the proper rides if you like. She follows. Followed. Gone. Well, so do I, actually. I pray to thee, God, guide Mary to a place uh, to peace in death. Thank you. She would have liked that. The gods won't listen to me. It's my fault she's dead. If I just kept my mouth shut about that bloody dowry, she'd still... She'd still be here. Well, this isn't on you. You couldn't not have known uh, your fate and stuff. I'm sorry, Mary. I'm so sorry. Please, just go. I need a moment with her. Uh, yeah, I, uh... Might need a moment with her as well. But let's do the uh, further investigation. Questioning of the dead in a future episode. If we even go and question that, we kind of don't need more further clues here. Kind of know what is uh, what's happened about here. So, um, I wish you all a very good day. Until the next episode, bye bye.